Welcome to the Wolf Pit. Today I'm going to make a succulent, moist and tender rotisserie duck with an Asian flair, but not to be confused with a Peking duck. I'm saving the Peking duck for another video as it's much more labor intensive and time consuming. Today's rotisserie duck is easy, simple and delicious, so let's get started. The star of the show is a six and a half pound Long Island duck and the first thing I'm going to do is remove the wing tips so they don't burn and get in the way. And now I'm going to fill the cavity of the duck with ginger, some star anise, some fresh garlic, a cinnamon stick, Chinese five spice powder, honey, and finally some hoisin sauce. Now push everything all the way up into the cavity and massage around. And now I'm going to tie the duck up to keep it all together while it's on the rotisserie. And with the first knot, I'm going to try to seal up the cavity as best I can. And now I'm going to tie the legs together. And now the wings. And now with a handful of paper towels, I'm gonna to dry the duck off as much as possible. And then this goes into the refrigerator for eight to 12 hours to air dry and marinate. And now I'm going to light the rear infrared burner on my Napoleon Mirage gas grill and I'm going to leave it on high and close the lid for about 10 minutes. Once the grill is preheated, I'm going to turn the rear infrared burner to medium. And of course, turn the rotisserie on. And now add the duck and make sure it turns properly and balanced. And I've also added a drip tray underneath the duck with a little bit of water in it to catch the fat. Now shut the lid and let the Napoleon do its thing. After 30 minutes, the duck is beginning to get a nice tan and smelling incredible. After an hour and 25 minutes, our duck is at 165 degrees. It's fully tanned and looks absolutely gorgeous. So I'm gonna pull it off and let it rest for at least 30 minutes before I slice it. And there you have it, a succulent, moist, tender, and delicious Asian style rotisserie duck. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you give this a try and I'll see you next time.